What a perfect day for football we've got here. Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler. Our football comes from La Liga, and the match starts very shortly. And it is Real Valladolid against Real Madrid. Well, there's certainly a buzz in this stadium in the uh, minutes leading up to kickoff. I hope the match doesn't disappoint. I don't think it will. We've got a couple of attacking sides here. Here's the powerhouse that is Romelu Lukaku. Well, those defenders have got to match his strength, his power, as well as his finishing ability. Real Valladolid go this way today. Two banks of four, 4-4-2. Four, four, yeah, how it always used to be. Don't see it quite so often these days, but uh, that's a classic formation and uh, really capable of causing problems here today. This is the Real Madrid lineup. In goal, Kepa Arisa Balaga. Ashraf Hakimi plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Eden Hazard starts alongside Isco in the middle of the park. And it's good to see that they've got two strikers looking to provide the goal threat for them. Everything ready for the kickoff. And he gets it returned to him. He fancies his chances in getting past these players. I think the cross is on. Far too close, the cross to the keeper. Romelu Lukaku. Intercepted well. There's a bit of cover, but he doesn't want to lose possession now. Lukaku. Azar. Delivered into the box. It's a brave effort, really, in amongst the players to get the header in, but off target, way off target. Yeah, not his best effort, that's for sure. Real Madrid, a real spring in there step on the back of that home win in their previous game against Espanyol yeah I mean you do feel that excitement is building after that result with a Champions League spot on the horizon but one thing oh they've opened the scoring here it's a good start it's a flying start really Well, I know they've been working on this all week long, Martin, and boy, has it paid dividends. Lovely finish. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Here's Isco, Azar, Ashraf Hakimi, Vallejo. Attacking now, able to stay on his feet well. Real Madrid given the throw here. Goal news from Atletico Madrid, from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Sebastian Haller. There must have been 40 passes leading up to this one. And here's the shot, it got in the way. The shoot, goal, they've hit back straight away, great reaction, no time to sulk about conceding, they have scored at the other end.
Well, it is the old cliche, Alan, isn't it? That you're most vulnerable when you've just scored, and that's the case here. But well played the opposition to hit back straight away. Yeah, and I think they did catch the opponents flat-footed there. They were still celebrating their goal, and the manager would be furious about that. So, away we go at one all. Apologies to Alan. Just had to cut him short there because of what's happening in front of us in this game. Atletico Madrid did score in that game. Confirmation of that. They are winning 1-0. Set up to play on the break now. He's go. Vallejo. He's go. He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Goal news from Barcelona. Alan McAnally is our man. It's a goal for Barcelona. 16 minutes played, 1-0. Eagle eyes, as always, from Alan McAnally. And that's given away possession. He's cut it out. Lukaku. He's goal. I think that's a decent save from the goalkeeper. Corner for Real Madrid. Here's Taylor. On the attack here. Space to cross the ball now. Certainly playing well enough to get their noses in front here. Towards the front post. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Lukaku. Well, our travelling reporter, Alan McAnally, is in the Coliseum, Alfonso Perez, today. And a goal, Alan. It's a goal for Athletic Bilbao. 23 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. We're back here again, thanks to Alan McAnally. Borja Mayoral. Azar. Can't keep the ball at the moment. Got a bit of pressure on. Read the play well. Very good challenge. Now, can he take them on? It's gone out and the referee's pointed for a corner. In goes the corner. Choosing to punch the corner away, the goalkeeper this time. He got in the way. Now, can he cross it? Whipped in towards the near post. The keeper stops it. There could be a follow-up now. Now Borja Mayoral. It's poor work, really. Di Marta. Can go in from here. What an important interception that was. And that header goes over the line, and it will be a throw. He's got a chance to cross. He has cleared it well. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Important touch from the defender there. They can be quick on the break now. Still progressing on the break. Guiding it through the defenders. Can't hang onto it, the keeper. Really good defence. And <laughs> the goalkeeper's got it at last. And this time, in a way, where he can take the heat out of the situation. It was pretty hot for him just before that, wasn't it? And what a very good save. Well, you saw how he moved about the goal there. He really does get up and down quickly. So agile, this keeper. Gives it away here, Thiago. Real Madrid had the ball. Thiago. Going forward with real purpose now. Well, they're sitting off the opposition here, and that can invite pressure. Well, there's no foul given. Oh, it must have been very close as he slid in. 
Let's check in with Alan McAnally at Barcelona with some goal news. It's a second goal for Barcelona. 37 minutes played, 2 0. Well, right on the spot there for that story, Alan McAnally, of course. Can he score and put them in front? And the keeper can collect this one. Lukaku. Azar. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Charlie Taylor. That's going to be a throw in after that tackle. It's a very good effort to stop that cross. Chance to get forward from the wing. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. And he's given the free kick. Just going to be a talking to. He's not reaching for a card. He's quite lucky there. Fortunate, to say the least. Is it going to be an in-swinger or an out-swinger? He can deliver these with both feet. Players in the wall jumping to get to that free kick. It's a bit risky. That's a corner for Real. And a possibility here of getting their noses in front from it. Lukaku! Oh, what a touch by the defender. He was so quick to get into position, to get his body in the way there. Corner swung in. Went with the header, and he's good in the air too, but not quite good enough then. Bit unfortunate. Next time, maybe he'll bury it. He's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. And he could get away here. Have a go with the volley. Well, that's his second today. He's certainly got his shooting boots on. And he is the kind of player that can hit his straps like this. Excellent day for him. Takes a lot of concentration, this kind of volley, and look at him, eyes fixed firmly on the ball. Gets it all right here. Let's have another peek at that goal. So Real Madrid are behind. It's Isco. Here's Vallejo. Not a great tackle, I must say. They've got the ball back by that interception. Well, that is half-time, and we've reached it at 2-1. just checking everything is in order and he blows for the second half to start well, he's read that hasn't he and made the interception made it look easy actually that's fair play he's got his body in there and he can protect the ball with his skill here's a chance to have a run at goal and take the opposition on and that'll be a throw Got a chance to cross. Now well, that's good defending. One of the players that we really thought at the start of the game would be the sort of guy we're talking at the end for the right reasons, but we might not uh, mention him in uh, a positive way the way he's played today. Well, he won't be happy to see opting to punch that corner away. Wants to have a go, and the keeper doing his job. Carvajal. 
It's with Marco Asensio. Really up and coming, Marco Asensio, and he's up and coming at the opposition. And we're getting news of a goal scored at the Ramon Sanchez Pichuan, and it's Alan McAnally to tell us about it. It's a second goal for Sevilla. 52 minutes played, 2 0. Eagle eyes, as always, from Alan McAnally. His teammates have recognised the potential. In with a chance. Good work by the goalkeeper. On EA Sports, a quick reminder the La Liga fixture coming up for Real Valladolid. They'll be facing Athletic Bilbao. Yep, three points at stake. It's a big match for both sides. Thiago. So easy in possession. The defenders managed to get in the way there. As for Real Madrid, their next game, Alan. Well, they're playing. And the referee looks to his assistant, who's got the flag up. It's offside. Ashraf Hakimi. It's Isco. Jovic. No threat now. There's been a goal, Alan McAnally's got news of it at the Wanda Metropolitano. It's the second goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Sebastian Haller. A suspicion of a foul as he climbed above his marker to head home. Good stop by the goalkeeper. Well, sitting back, it's a bit of a policy here. And letting the opposition come at them, risky. Now a chance to get a bit of width into this attack. Now they can swing into attack, and he's got some help. Can really get at the opposition here. Keeper's ball, no question about that. It was a weak cross, really. It's Isco. Eden Hazard, Jovic. Now Borja Mayoral. Carvajal, Thiago. Here's Isco, Luka Jovic, Borja Mayoral, Thiago, a real opening for him, terrific stop. Goal news from Barcelona, Alan McAnally's our man. It's a third goal for Barcelona, 63 minutes played, 3-0. Thanks, Alan. Keeping the ball is one thing, but they've got to try and open up the opposition. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. It's with Marco Asensio. Made a quick interception. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. What a brilliant goal. Well, how long's it been on? One or two minutes, I'm not sure, but he's marked his appearance here with a wonderful goal. Oh, as a centre forward, I can appreciate the movement in the box there and certainly the header at the end of it. Let's see the replay now. Oh, he's got to make a change, this manager, because uh, it's men against boys. He needs to give them a lift, a substitution, I would imagine. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scoreline. Taking on the defenders. And the referee lets them go on. Advantage played by him. Cross towards Marco Asensio. Cleared away, well away from goal. And 20 minutes to go. Romero, just a period of keeping the ball for the team that are winning the match. Oh, great chance! And that is quite a wild effort at goal, although he got good contact on the ball. Carvajal. Borja Mayoral, able to intercept here. Stayed on his feet and won the ball.
He's made the interception. Goal news from Sevilla, from Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Sevilla. It's been scored by Luke de Jong. That's his second today. The defender was trying to play out of defence and gave the ball away, leaving only the keeper to beat. 76 minutes played, 3-0. We're back here again, thanks to Alan McAnally. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Well defended, not just getting across, he thought quickly as well. Spaced across the ball now. Could have done better with the cross into the goalkeeper's reach. Threads it through. They read the opponent's mind and got the ball. Tight scenario here on the ball. Romero, ten minutes left of regular time. It goes out wide again. Opportunity to cross it now. Time for an update from Atletico Madrid and a goal in that game from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Villarreal. Seven minutes remain, 3-1. Eagle eyes, as always, from Alan McAnally. Let's fly! Just a matter of concentration with the goalkeeper. A simple shot to field. Yeah, his positioning was spot on. He made it look easy, which it was, to be fair. Borja Mayoral. Thiago. Good pull. Great pull from Thiago. Well, is it too little too late? There's still time on the clock. They need one more to get something from the game. Chance of levelling it up now just won the difference well that goal's got the team going and it's made this crowd this stadium change its attitude too real noise in here very good game 3-2 trying to get the ball in behind what a goal it's a super moment for a team that just knows how to fight back they've fought back from two goals behind to be level again well, this is when it's tough being a goalkeeper. A little bit more on it, and it would have been a very fine save. As it is, he's picking the ball out of the net. Yeah, he sets high standards, this lad, and I think he's just dropped below those. Let's have another peek at that goal. Two teams brilliantly matched in this contest. It's level again. Hector. It's good attacking play this from them. Well, how has he done that? He's cut out the most dangerous of attacks at the most dangerous of times. They've been trying to do this, get the ball over the top. Really good defending. If he hadn't touched it, it was a goal. Now, one of the keepers thanking him for that bit of closing down by his defender. Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Maybe he'll cross it here. Well, it was considered controlled attacking play. But it's come to nothing in the end. Chance to get forward from the wing. He's got the option to get in across now. And there it is, the referee has brought a halt to it all, with the team still all square. Wow, it was a disappointment when the final whistle went. We could have done with it going on and on and on. It was that good. Now, you almost get the feeling that the players didn't want the ref to blow the final whistle. It's a great performance, particularly in the circumstances, Alan. Well, he played really well, got himself a couple of goals. He'll just be disappointed he didn't earn his team the full three points.